get the camera and I'll show you around. All right, so we got our first order. We're going to the restaurant and actually I just pressed, all I did was I opened the app, I signed in, I said I'm ready to go. So we're just making our way over to the restaurant and then I'll see, I have to swipe this thing that says that I'm at the restaurant and then I guess the restaurant finds out that I'm here and then I walk in with the bags. You guys like, what's the number? So apparently there's a number on the app that you have to read to them and then they give you the food. But the nice thing is the bag, like the, the actual bag is really, really, really big. So like, it doesn't matter what you order, it's probably gonna fit, like it's huge. There it is. So now we're driving to the person's house and they live at, no, I'm joking. What's wrong with the way I drive? Parked at customer. I'm here. Deliver order. I don't get it. Delivered one order. Deliver order. I don't know what I'm doing. I think it's that one. It's gotta be that one. He doesn't know what he's doing. They're just not answering? Yeah, I'm not. No one's answering. I've been trying to I've been trying to call the customer, but no one's answering a text message I could you can text or you can call and then skip the dishes sends an email you can even tell them to that was for sure the right building yeah the right address it's just a door you can't even get in they're not even answering right like yeah like even if I can get into the building it doesn't mean anything yeah I have to meet them at the door so what do we do I'll send another message to them and see <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be if this is any indication on how the yeah. next one's gonna be it's gonna be insane <laughs> okay so that's that's what's happening i'm, I'm gonna wait all of our team members are helping other callers for fastest response please email us at support at skip the dishes.com this is crazy i can't believe this is our first delivery this is the word oh thank you for reaching out we will reassign this order what does that mean? So it's 6.48, we got here at 6.29. Do you know anyone that skipped the dishes and delivers food and waits 20 minutes for someone to come down from the building? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're also starving, we haven't had dinner. The food smells kind of good. Customers for... isn't answering for their food. Do I leave now? Oh, okay. That's a better question. <laughs> okay, next. Like, we're not gonna sit here all day. We're committed, Don. This music driving me crazy. Why isn't the office answering? I feel neglected. We will try to contact the customer on our end. Please be patient. Okay. There's obviously no one answering these text messages. <laughs> Since we are unable to contact the customer, please keep the order with you until the end of your shift. Let's do it. All right, let's go. How do they know where I'm going? You're doing great. We should do this only on a motorcycle. I, that, the last one was a lot easier. I walked in and I just gave him the uh, the order number. I'm like, oh, order number ending in blah, blah, blah. Okay, so that one went really well. So I guess the good tip would be like, make sure you eat before you go. And make sure you have gas in the car. Oh yeah, and you're supposed to have change. In case people have to pay cash. Which I don't have. Matt signed up for this shift and didn't prepare at all, basically. Typical Matt. And you said, no, we'll just eat on the way. I'm like, what do you mean eat on the way? <laughs> it's crazy. We have to deliver the food to someone on a train. No, we don't. So we were able to do a quick stop and ask for a break. We needed a break. I know a lot of people usually just do skip the dishes by themselves, but we were doing it together. We eat together, we skip the dishes together. I mean, for one person, it's more worth it. It's easier with two people. You mean it's not worth it if there's two people? <laughs> well, no. <laughs> well, for an hour, we made $30. Yeah. You probably only like that when you're busy, though. 
That's a good point. So That's a lot. If your gas and your data. Worth $30. I'll get back to you when I've done two hours. Yeah. You know what would be awesome right now? If we got a call, I've always wanted to do this. I have the window open, the call comes through, like finish the last bite, throw it out the window. <laughs> it's like those cop TV shows. Don't waste the pizza, it's too expensive. <laughs> Let's go. Put the siren on. I wanted to tell you guys how that whole like setting up my account with Skip the Dishes went. But honestly, it's like super, super boring. Like I thought you, you'd be able to sign up within an hour and then get on the road. Cause like Uber, you do it right away. Like as soon as you sign up, they, you know, you send them some paperwork, blah, blah, blah. And all of a sudden you're like driving already with them. With Skip the Dishes, not only did we have to buy $70 of bags, but we also had to, I did an hour long interview on the phone where they explained to you all like the stupid phone stuff. Then the bags, I had to go to a location to pick up the bags. And those are all separate days. So like a cumulative, like if when you want to- When did you pay for the bag? When? Mm -hmm. I did. Oh, you paid for it? Yeah. So we have to make our money back. Order some food! Yeah, so overall when, so registering for skip the dishes it does take i would say it takes about a week to get everything in order and all this just to hang out in the parking lot shouldn't have went on break the prime hours are probably like four to seven anyways yeah so if you're thinking about doing that that's that's the breakdown i didn't want to start this video with this because it's kind of boring hey we got an hey look at the lights in the car that's we got another order we're dropping it off let's go i would like to note that matt just kind of looks like a creeper like creeping around people's yards. That was super creepy. Do you want to end shift now or do you want to stay on shift? Up to you. All right guys, so I think this is it. I think that's the end of the night, unless we get another order. I would have squeezed it in this video before this happened. We were on a on-call shift for four hours and we made $39. So that, but that's also like, you gotta think like, we also drove around. How much gas do you think we spent? 10 bucks? So it wasn't a very busy night. Tonight is a, like during the week to Wednesday. If you have any questions about skip the dishes and I can answer it like go ahead and ask me and I'll answer them if I can or I'll find the answer somehow but yeah other than that you guys keep your vlog life life please don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you guys next week for another vlog